Hello guys and welcome to this video about this Mac Mini that I got cheap. As you may or may not know, I'm uh, quite into buying and selling vintage Apple computers. However, I am collecting at the moment and this came up really cheap on Gumtree. So I thought, how could I pass it up? Anyway, let's take a look. Oh yes, also included was this full HD Dell monitor, keyboard, mouse, all the cords and the Mac Mini itself with the accessories. Well, here it is in its 2010 model glory. Anyway, I'll oh, just bump the tripod. Anyway, so this is it, Mac Mini. Uh, yeah, you know, good old stuff. Uh, focusing might be a bit difficult. Um, so it's a 2.4 gigahertz with um, two gigs of memory model. Yeah, okay, so here it is. This is the machine itself. So I've cleaned it up personally and it looks like brand new. And um, I don't really have a need for it to be quite honest. So there's the machine itself, looks quite, quite nice, very, very nice. Anyway, we'll cast that to a side for just one moment as we go and look at what else we have in the box. So we've got the power cord, as well as the HDMI to DVI, as well as the VGA to a mini display port. Now, as well as that, we've also got discs, which we do like, and I have done a system restore on it, and it's fine. There was one problem when I bought it. Apparently, the, uh, the disk drive didn't work. So I, I side-loaded a um, copy of Mac OS 6 on there, and um, what do you know, the software fixed that problem right up. And at the rear of the Mac Mini, we have the power, Ethernet, uh, Firewire 800, HDMI, Mini Display Port, four USB 2 ports. I think there's audio in uh, and out, as well as an SDXC card slot. Okay, voila, and there we go, completely set up. So I think it's time we boot this little thing up. Let's do this. So, there we go, and there is the inevitable rolling shutter, which seems to happen for some reason because of the refresh rates of the camera, and I couldn't be bothered changing any of this. Actually, I probably should. But either way, uh, it is a Core 2 Duo, 2 gigab with 2 gigabytes of RAM, and yeah, it's it's good. So you might be wondering how much I actually paid for this whole lot. And you would be quite surprised. So with the with the whole lot, the monitor, everything, all the accessories, I paid $230, which I believe is quite a good deal. And I'm going to sell it on because I really don't have a need for it, but I saw the opportunity to at least double my money. So, thanks for watching and uh, next time we will be taking a look at that thing, the old Lime iBook G3 which I got from a quite a fortunate source, let's just say. So, thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time.